Thank you. You know, it's not even Thanksgiving, and already you guys are shipping holiday gifts. Yeah, we are. Whether they're ordering gifts online or sending them to family far away, Americans beginning to send and receive more packages. Garrett Berger visited with the UPS team at the airport, and they show us how busy things get, but also what you need to know. Check it out. It's not really ever a slow day at UPS's San Antonio Gateway at the airport, but the week of Thanksgiving, air shipping traffic starts to ramp up and doesn't drop back to normal until about the new year. I can tell you this is kind of like our Super Bowl. So we ramp up, our people are pumped, we're ready to go. Things may already be busy now, but it's going to get even more so as you get closer to the holidays, culminating in what they call peak week, the week before Christmas. The San Antonio Gateway normally sees seven cargo jets in and seven cargo jets out on any given day. By peak week, there'll be nine in and nine out. And in the last minute rush, there'll be about 69% more next day air packages passing through San Antonio International Airport on December 23rd than on any average day. So what do you need to know? The best advice boils down to four words. Plan early, plan ahead. The Martinez says UPS is aiming for a very high on-time completion rate. Things like weather could still spoil your plans. Fortunately, though, she says the extensively reported global supply chain issues should not, as long as the company you're buying from has the product on hand. We really don't see much of that. It hasn't affected us whatsoever. In case you do run into inventory issues on the retail side, UPS recommends shoppers having a backup plan, such as gift cards. Well, so how much time do you have to get your packages off in time for Christmas? Well, UPS wants customers to check their website for estimates, so you have to go on to find specific pickup and delivery locations. While well, FedEx and the post office gave a December 15th cutoff for some of their common delivery services. That's just three weeks from today. Now, of course, all these have rush services too, but if you're like me, you'd much rather be spending your money on the gifts, not shipping them. Live in the newsroom, I'm Gary Berger, KSAT 12 News.